find all real numbers that satisfy sine x equals one half. So we need to find a solution of that, correct? And we can do that by using the inverse sine. So we can say the inverse sine of one half equals what? Well, I know that what value is going to give me one half? Well, it's going to be pi over six. Remember, you can use the unit circle if those still don't just roll right off of you. Um, we need to know the period so that we need to know if we need to find another terminal side. So the period of sine is two pi. So for the first one here, I'm going to get pi over six plus, remember you take two times pi times k for any k that is an integer. Now, is there another point that's going, or an angle that's going to have the same terminal side as pi over six? Well, there is. It's going to be five pi over six. So if that's the case, I still need to write out that formula, so it's going to be plus. It's still a period of two pi. Multiply it by k for any k that is an integer.